Hello and welcome to another Teacher's Corner. I'm Teacher Kirby and uh, today we'll be covering actually another quality of life improvement. Um, this is one of those things that uh, Cheddar on the team speak stopped and went, wait, you can do that? So it's going to, we're going to be talking about um, modifying your notification settings. What this will do is this will stop the um, fly-in messages that somebody got a certain ship or different uh, fly-in messages like so-and-so earned this accolade or you know things like that those really annoying things that everybody just sits there and goes ugh no kind of thing so I'm just making a generic new character here and picking random name because I don't care. This is so that you can see the default settings once I create my character. Okay. And I'm not even going to go through the tutorial. I'll tell it to skip. Let me get it loaded here. Okay. Yes, I'd like to skip the tutorial. All right. And loading Starfleet Academy. All right, so as I said, I just made a random character. And you see there's all these fly-ins coming. And so what I'm looking for is actually down here at my chat window, which I'm going to make a little bigger. Okay, so you will see I'm looking for the little gearbox at the end of the bar where I type my messages and you see I have quite a few things I have set channel find team friends emotes notification settings chat settings my mic volume mic test etc I want notification settings and you'll notice oh my gosh here they are these are the notification settings that end up annoying the heck out of people notice there are two lines. There's chat with check boxes and there's fly-ins with check boxes. Now I don't want the admin announcements. These are the things like so-and-so want a ship. Gameplay announcements, I don't care about those either. So I'm going to check those off. If I still want them to come into chat because I want to see it, I can leave those boxes checked, but I can check or uncheck those as I see fit. Same thing with inventory. I don't need it flying in telling me I received an item in inventory. I also don't need it telling me I removed it or that I opened up a reward pack. So I can get rid of those. If I still want them in chat, I can feel free to leave it there. Same thing with mission started, mission turn in, mission dropped. I can even take on mission failed. See, I can turn off all of these things. Okay, I can take off officer training. I don't want that. I can take off see all of these lovely things. I don't need fleet feedback or message of the day flying in. Cue feedback I can leave in. I don't need mail. I don't need duty officer assignment feedback. And I certainly don't need help pop-ups. So as you can see, I can check off all of these things and make my list a little cleaner. I can also get rid of all of them in chat if I wish to. So that is your quality of life improvement for this week. I'm Teacher Kirby. This has been Teacher's Corner. You can hear the discussion of Teacher's Corner live every Wednesday on the show at 10 p.m. Eastern.